Hey everybody, Solar World, I'm coming to you guys with part 2 of Spyro Attack of the Rhinox. So, let's get on with it. Um, I did not actually mean to press that switch. But, I actually need to figure out where to go in this library. As you guys may have noticed, um, have you found the machine yet or its parts? Um, no, we don't need you yet. I don't know where we're gonna find it, and my little kitty Angel decided to show up. She might attack me while I record. She tends to do that every time I record. It's kind of annoying, but oh well. She's a kitty, what can you do? Plus you must think it's weird that I record all by myself. And there's gotta be some way to open up, um, you know, that chest and all that. Ah, poop. Uh, you get it. Just circles around if you miss your destination. Bee! Flying higher than a bee. Oh no. Death comes when you go over there. And you guys die already. Okay, maybe we have to leave. Because apparently we didn't find the little red guy in here. We didn't find... Unless that was the toy. I think that was the toy. I don't think there's anything else in here. And I really don't think we have the ability to um, open the chests yet. So let's go back to the foyer. And, you know, look for stuff to do. There might be some kind of hidden secret around here somewhere. I don't know why that... I don't know why that... Thanks for helping us, the pilot. You're so brave. Yeah, because I'm so brave because I literally used my fire breath to open something for you guys. Okay, there's nothing in here. I don't think we're gonna find anything else in the fairy library. And let's go back to the Dragon Shores nest region. Uh, we can go down here, I believe. Yep, we haven't been down here yet. I don't know if I like the whole world set up in the money bags. Good heavens, my dear, dear friend Spyro. I was just out for a stroll when I happened across this ghastly little plaything. Right, how much do you want for it? Spyro, I'm surprised at you. However, my mansion does have its maintenance costs. What say I part with this trick for a paltry 300 gems? How does that sound? Yeah, whatever. Ah, oh, lovely, lovely gems. I knew I could count on you, Spyro. Here's the item, as promised. Wow, Sprout, you have your own action figure. This is really cool. Fully posable toy. It's one of the toys the Dragon Elder is looking for. Okay, cool. We got a toy that we needed, which is always good news. And bananas. What's this? Rhinox have taken the bridge out to the Banana Savannah. Huh. There's an area called the Banana Savannah. Oh, and we can't get over there yet. Assuming we're gonna need some kind of power up or something for that, just kind of like a lot of this area looks inaccessible to us. At least at this given time. I hate that the enemies respawn though if you turn the game off. We need to get up there. How do I get up there? And this is just the beach that we came on, I believe. Oh, it might be over here. This is the beach where we came from. Okay! I was clearly holding down L, but it decided not to. And what do you have to say? Uh, source of all information. Yeah, you guys don't actually give me a single ounce of information about Dragon Shores. And why are the fairies living in Dragon Shores anyway? I guess there were always fairies in the Spyro series, but... Uh, not that many, and... You got some goodies here, buddy. Hey -ya! You got anything? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're just the toy guy. Oh, how did I miss those then if I grabbed all those goodies? I guess maybe the fairy library is the only place we can actually access right now. And there's still toddlers missing. Yeah, I know there are toddlers missing. I just wish I could. Just wish I could get up there, but I can't. Can you shut up? I don't need to talk to you guys every time I step in front of you. It's a little unnecessary, don't you think? 
Meh. Hey there, dude. Hey there, sheepy. I wanna go to the banana savannah, man. But I don't think we really got the option to. Doesn't look like we can do anything unless. Somebody's doing something in the kitchen, at least. I don't know what's going on in there right now, but... I think one of my little buddies is playing around. Well, let's go back to the library. Apparently, there's nothing to do in there. I don't exactly get where we're supposed to go. Like, we have a mission. Like, um... We got the little rhino. We're missing some kind of paper. Um... L, L, and R. There's the toy quest. There's the Zoe machine quest. Oh, we did get one of the pieces. Hearts of the land. Ability items. Um, percentage. We're at 5% of the game done completely. Library. 16% library. done there. We got the... Finish the books here. Like, I don't... We're 59% done this area, but I don't know... Where else to go, really? And, oh yeah, we don't have the ability to double jump in this game like later Spyro games. I miss the ability to double jump in the games. No, I don't need you. The pilot light is completely useless. We already finished that quest. Um, so yeah, I think we actually have to go in here. Maybe defeat all the enemies, I guess? Probably just missing like one pathway, but... A real bummer. We put out all the fires and everything. Hmm. So there's nothing over there. I know where this bug takes us. He takes us across really far. Yeah, so we'll just we'll just check out this bug for a second. We'll fly across. There's footprints right here. I don't know why. Oh, it's because we did something over here, right? Yeah, see, there's nothing to do over here. This one just brings me back. Okay, kill off some of these enemy. Wait, hang on. Before we do anything... There's nothing over there. We really got the little red creature that, you know, doesn't say a word that we picked up. That was just the toy. We already went into the vault. Um, I don't care. I'm not looking for the mission. Well, I am, but I'm not at the same time. This bug is very misleading. See, I need to be able to open the chests. But I'm not able to. Okay, bug. Let's go back. Uh, this this hunt is so annoying. I wonder if that's all the enemies yet. Probably one up here. There's like nothing up here though. So that's the thing I find with this area. Like, there's not much to do. It's very short. Like, look at this. The majority of the level is simply just, you know, emptiness. I don't know how there's, like, the gems have to be in that frickin', um, the little red guy with the horn on his head in the one XYZ section. He yeah, asked not to be disturbed, though. I did hear him mumble your name. Yeah, I believe we already did that. Oh, Spyro, those run after making it possible, and they're ruining the decor, putting up those nasty banners. Oh, wait a minute. Guys, those banners are actually flammable. Or flammable. Well, I know, flammable in the sense that, you know, we're allowed to flame them. But they're flammable, too, in the sense that, you know... Well, flammable, we can destroy them. Flammable is in the ignite, so we actually may have found... 
a way to get more gems. Maybe those chests are not actual gems. Maybe they're just, you know, decoration. Well, that's good news. We actually found something to do. Ah, oh, they only seem to drop reds, though. It's a little disappointing, but, eh. Here, let me see if there's anything in the, uh, vault that we missed. Just, you know, double check. You never know. We could always miss something. Let's check in the fairy library. Uh, money, money, money. See, there's another one of these things here. But they don't do anything, so I'm not quite sure if we're actually intended to do something with them or not. Which is, you know, the part that I want to figure out. Because if we can do something with them, then... We may be able to progress with the story a little more. Stop with the machine part! No! I don't need to talk to you about the machine part. I already know about the machine part. I had to personally flame those things, because you guys can't do it with your magic, apparently. Okay, I don't think there's anything there I need, but there's stuff here I need. Ooh, a five. So we are currently at, I believe, 366. So maybe those chests do have gems in them still, and we're, not just, we're just not going to get them all yet. Okay, I hate these banners because depending on your positioning, you cannot flame them. See, like, they're still... Okay, that was my phone. If you guys could hear that, I apologize. I'll check that after this episode. I don't know, maybe if I kill off everything... ...and burn all the banners, maybe I can get something out of it. Ah, I already, you know... I swear that's just... Wait, no, this is the XYZ section. Ha! Ah, looking for a way into the Dragon Coast Spiral? This spell book might help you. I've been reading through it, and boy, are there some great spells in it. Like this one. Bwahaha. -ha. You created some soldiers. And this one. I've got to be going now, Spyro. You want the book? Then try and get it. Bwahaha. -ha. Wait, why would you give me the book? Okay, that doesn't seem very difficult. Other than the fact that I got hit by him. Okay, don't die to him. There we go. We can't read any of the spells in this book, but it glows with magic. This book gives you quick escape ability. Spire, you can select it from the menu and return to Dragon Trust from anywhere. Oh, okay. That's actually pretty helpful. But how do we not end up in here? I swear we came through the store before. I have been looking everywhere for where to go, and it's been under my nose the entire time. Like, jeez louise, man. Still doesn't tell me how to open up these chests, though. There's gotta be another ability for that, or something. There are lots of gems up here, too, so... Maybe not. Yeah, like, there's three tens right there. Oops, no, I meant to actually press, um, uh, L select, or L start, pardon me. Um, yeah, there's not that many gems left. I don't think we're gonna find them all in here, maybe. Oh, we could, actually, if they're all gonna be fives and tens. I don't think that would be the even amount, though. Because then I'm pretty sure the missing gems would then be, um banners and stuff uh, so yeah nothing in here at the moment no uh, banners or anything sir the nasty monster is gone thank you Spyro you're welcome lady thank you for the health again oh my god there's a door right there mm. how am I that dumb 
<clears throat> Sometimes you just gotta pay attention a little more. Pay attention to detail. Okay, I'm pretty sure... Wait, what? Oh, the oh, no, never mind. That's the bug. Okay. Um, yeah. So, nothing here. No banners or anything. Up here, maybe? Yeah, the I know I helped you with the uh, heater. Oh, yeah. There is nothing more here. <laughs> maybe. Maybe we're just missing something. I don't know, I always feel like you can get up past this one spot up here, but you can't. I don't get why you have to talk to them every time. Like, it should be like a press A or B or something in front of them thing. Well, maybe the one that, you know, tells us that there's, like, monsters and stuff around here can help us. Nope, still doesn't say anything new. So I'm pretty sure we're not done that mission. It's like, XE summon section. I don't think there's anything in here, though. Might have to call it an episode and then just look for it on my own time. As sad as that sounds, I might actually have to. Like, there's, like, nothing to destroy. There's nothing, you know, around the area or anything like that. Um... I don't even think we got an ability to do anything other than the ability to teleport home. Which is fine and dandy, but... Doesn't really help us too much. Like, I don't know how to open those. Like, there's no banners around here. There are no enemies. I don't know what we're missing. So, I think I'm going to call it an episode. And in the next episode, what I'm going to do is I'm going to figure out where to go. Maybe open up the chests and do things like that. And yeah, that's about it. See you guys next time for the third part of this game.